Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, I am doing these voiceovers with Luca here so if you hear him in the background just ignore it. So today's video is a bit different than my usual videos and I'm also not going on with my story in this video. I just wanted to <laughs> explain to you what I'm doing and it's funny because I totally wanted to call this video having a meltdown on camera but uh, yeah i didn't <laughs> so i actually had black hair before i went blonde and it was such a long and difficult process without damaging your hair and putting bleach in your hair so i never want to go dark again but for everybody that's blonde you will know it's such a mission to keep it blonde i mean you pretty much have to go to the salon every three months to put foils in and at the moment you know we can't afford that so i just wanted to make my hair a color that i can kind of do at home i must say i'm a bit disappointed with this color yes i didn't choose too dark but it's like the color didn't make much of a difference you can see a little difference but even now i washed my hair obviously a few times after this um video and it's kind of washed out already so i'm a bit disappointed but it's fine mm, yeah i didn't want to go too dark and then of course i wanted to make my hair shorter because it is summer now and with me being home with Luca I don't always have time to put on makeup and you know do my hair and all of that so I kind of wanted it shorter just to be more manageable but also again I was so bloody scared to do it on my you know at home by myself so I didn't go too short I actually want to make it shorter so maybe there will be another video <laughs> me going way short but i didn't want to go too short because if i did mess it up i can at least go to the salon and let them cut it properly you know what i mean so um yeah that was basically it but obviously i just put my color in then i washed it out and um it took me forever and ever and ages to brush my hair out like and this is why i don't wash my hair upside down i didn't film washing it um but i actually basically just bend it over the bathtub and washed it out so i washed my hair upside down and it knotted my hair so badly and that's why it took so long to brush it out Seventy five years.
okay after i brushed my hair out which took two hours i just divided my hair straight in the middle and braided my hair to the side i felt comfortable with this because this is actually how i have many times cut my own ends you know just a tiny bit and it came out fun so i felt comfortable with it to cut it short and it actually came out pretty even it i mean it's not even even like you'll get in the salon but it didn't look too bad or it doesn't look too bad it's it's not that uneven so yeah i obviously also watched a lot of youtube videos how to do your hair and i don't know these ladies went all with different sections and i'm like i won't be able i would would have probably messed it up way worse if i went all like section for section for section it was it just looked too difficult so if you do want to cut your hair just braid it like like i say it's not obviously as even as you want it like you'll get it in the salon but i'm pretty sure everybody that wants to cut their hair at home you're not looking for perfection i mean you're never gonna get it as perfect as you would in the salon obviously because we're not all hairdressers but it came out pretty good for braiding your hair it looked yeah, you'll see at the end. Uh, what? It's gone. It's all gone.
wanted to give a shout out to all the stay at home mamas like this has been such an adventure for me like wow i mean i've worked since i was 18 years old like most of us do and there was a while that i stayed home with clayton but it wasn't very long and obviously you know if you had have kids you kind of forget how it is and then you go have another one and you're like oh shit okay now I remember but now with me staying home with Luca I swear it's more work than working getting home cleaning cooking looking after the kids homework don't get me wrong each and every job and each and every person with what they have to do is difficult but it's so much work guys like there's no second for yourself you can't just sit and relax or watch a tv show or you know just have a minute to yourself it's like non-stop going and when he naps like i mentioned in my previous video I either clean or do something for my channel or you know sort out other chores I have to do and it's literally cooking every five minutes because he eats so much and he wants to do obviously you know play around and he wants to color in and I still I'm still trying to teach him stuff and he wants to go walk around and guys these days that I reach my step limit by 12 o'clock already and 8 o'clock I'm asleep like I'm so bloody tired at night <laughs> so it's not an easy job I wish I could just stay home and like chill every day but this is not it and I just wanted to give a shout out to all the mamas out there or even dads that stay at home with their kids like oh my goodness they are so much work but I'm also actually loving every second like I can see such a big difference in him already like I can't explain it he's just very different and he, yeah he's changing by the minute and it's actually so sad because if you have small kids it's so difficult and you get so tired and you get so sad sometimes because it's a lot of work and you're tired and it's yeah and then you actually look back how grown up they are already and how they changed and then you get also sad like i don't know parenthood is such a roller coaster I hope you guys enjoyed today's video please like and subscribe if you did and i know it was obviously a random video and just weird but yeah i just wanted to film it and put it on my channel and i've also realized <laughs> i don't want to be negative but there is just no way that i unfortunately will make my thousand subscribers and four thousand watch hours in a year's time i only have i think like six or five months left and the channel is <laughs> sadly just not where i thought it would be by now but i'm not gonna stop like i say I, i'm just filming these videos for fun and as Ben and my best friend also reminds me every day, just do it for you. Just upload your videos for you. It's This channel is basically for me. And I still appreciate each and everybody that subscribes and watches <laughs> every video. Of course, that's just a bargain and I love you all. But it's sad to realize that, yeah, I'm not, it's just not going where I wanted it to, to go. If all of the kings had their queens on the throne We would pop champagne and raise a toast To all of the queens who are fighting alone Baby, you're not dancing on your own Can't live without me, you are never too can Na-na-na, think it's funny But honey, can't run this show